normal ambulance so I wonder what happened in here I have seen some things in my time in the street, but seeing a sofa. Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new video. And in this video, I'm going to be having a little wander around town. It is on a Sunday morning. Um, we've got a couple of runners and things on the prom, so I'll show you that a bit soon. So I just want to know what's happening. It is quite warm today. That's why I only got a police on and not a jacket. And I thought I'll just show you around here what's happening today in Blackpool. Oh, that's a good sound when you got the thing, the Blackpool Council out cleaning the streets first thing in the morning. Right, and I don't know what's happening over here, but you got a police, on police force, should we say. And we got two lots of ambulances. You got an ambulance car and also a normal ambulance. So I wonder what's happening here. They're like a more beauty suit to stop at the corner here and that looks like it getting some work done to it. I don't know what it's going to change into. So it looked like them being in a bit of old work I think happening here. So just behind that old wall mill now and I don't know what's happening with this building. It's been empty as long as I knew. Um, so they could do something with it. I think it's a grade two list building, so they probably can't do now like structure or change that outside. I don't know how all that work. But up and literally walking down here, I forgot what this street called now. But you got a couple of slippery to some things on the left hand side. I think you got a cafe at the bottom, and this like this picture up near there. Abbey Street um, Market thingy, what is now a food court, if you don't know. That changed about a year or two now. I came outside the Marigold, just, just between Corn Street and Church Street, and it looked like they are getting a bit of work doing to it. I'm not too sure what type of work they're getting done, like, getting done to there, but I would want it to show you. So, as you can tell, you've got like scaffolding and things so, and it looks like it, like a construction site type of entrance, so I wonder what is happening. So when you go into town, this little helper of mine like grabbing new things. What you got today, mate? You got a dinosaur grabber. <laughs> so I'm just walking back down Church Street now, and as you can tell, there is a other um, police vehicle. I don't know what happened today in Blackpool, but there seem to be quite a couple of police about. As you can tell, the promenade is sort of closed up today through the runners ABC I think and it is one like the marathons and, and like other events like the half room marathons and things Right, just walking in like the centre of the town now um, up near the greedy pig and things and as you can tell it is quite busy came onto the prom and we got the runners ABC I think the website is called but I'll put the website down below in the description it is still quite early in the morning but they do have a couple of runners about on the promenade As you can tell, the horses have been relocated just from the just next to the Golden Mile. We got them still running down the pond. We got a couple of people running here. <laughs> Martin guys, so it'd be rude of me to not show you the sea and the weather in Blackpool. Like, having a little wonder around. 
So you got the scene at the minute, but as you can tell, it's lovely and calm compared to what it had been. The weather is lovely today. The work has on Wadley, but it hasn't been confirmed or anything yet by the news or things like the minute, like suspicion or just people saying that. So like what I said, it hasn't been confirmed, they're only going off what other people saying because I haven't witnessed that myself. So I just wanted to have a little backup walk to the shop where it meant to happen and things. As you can see, whatever have happened, the police is still there. Just outside that phone shop. But like what I said, it does what people said, so you can't just like assume on things in this day and age. But if what they said is true, then it's just a shame. It just it's like a phone business just trying to make a living and things. And I know I know like you see it on YouTube a lot, like phone shops and all that always big targets and things. Was it probably just easy to sell phones on without getting like detected and all that? But hopefully, whatever I've gone on, everyone is okay in there and you know, get back into the swinger business very shortly.